Hello everyone and welcome to Long's Toys. Today we'll be taking a look at the Battle Armored Green Ranger from the Power Rangers Imaginex line. As you can see you get kind of a translucent, what I call Jolly Rancher version of the Green Ranger with a little Dragon Zord armor. You get a Dragon Dagger and then this kind of tail weapon. So very, very cool. I love the Dragon Zord. It's one of my favorite uh, Zords when I was a kid. I always just thought he looked really neat. And as you can see, it goes over top very similar to the Tyrannosaurus armor we looked at previously. Generic stock photo on the back here. So that is going to be it for the packaging. Let's get this guy open and we'll take a closer look. So here is everything you get in the packaging. You get the Dragon Dagger. Whoops. And it does have a peg hole in the back and you'll see where that comes into play later. Now just to uh, bring in the Green Ranger that comes in the two pack, here is the Dragon Dagger that he comes with and obviously this is a much smaller <laughs> Dragon Dagger. Now I think this one actually looks better as far as size goes. I think for size proportions it's better. But this one obviously has more paint applications. This one also actually has the Dragon Foot, the Dragon Coin molded on there as opposed to this one. So if we could just get from here, like the blade part of the paint job on this one, I think this would be the definitive Dragon Dagger. Otherwise, I think it looks pretty good. Just a little bit more paint here on the blade part and we would be in business. This one has a ton more paint, but doesn't have the coin molded and it's way too long in my opinion, but not terrible. So let's go ahead and put this back in his hand. And you can see the difference in the two Green Rangers. Pretty much identical except for the translucent plastic. He obviously doesn't have the silver painted on the top either, which I tend to like better, but that's just my personal preference. Put this guy back over here. Uh, shine some light through the back. You can see he is translucent. He lights up. Pretty cool. Looks like he's made of kryptonite or something. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so I like the figure. Like I said, I kind of like the lack of the silver paint on the top of the helmet. If I could just get one like this with a shield and non-translucent, it would be perfect. And I really do like this Dragon Dagger. I think they did a nice job with this. I really do think this is a better size. And I love the fact that the, the coin is molded in there correctly. As far as the little Dragon Zord goes, he's very similar to <laughs> the little T-Rex. As you can see, it's pretty much the same mold, just obviously tweaked. Transforms the same way. They did a great job. I love this little, like, super deformed dragon zord. The red eyes look great. All the paint here on the crest, I think, looks really, really nice. On the side over here. They did a pretty great job with this. I really like this a lot. Now, he comes with this uh, tail sword that, obviously, the Green Ranger can wield. If we plug this in, like this, but if you take it out, you can actually turn this like that, and then rotate this up, and then this tab, very similar to how the weapon pegged into the back of the T-Rex, just like that, and then you can kind of push this against the body. So yeah, I think he looks great with his little tail, really, really cool. The other thing you can do, take the Dragon Dagger, and you see this big large peg that's what that peg hole in the back is for so you can actually store both weapons here on the back which is pretty cool i like that i mean theoretically if he's controlling the dragon zord he has the the dragon dagger but still neat that you can put it on there for storage but yeah i really like the dragon dagger just wish it had that extra little bit of paint on there then it'd be perfect let's go ahead and get them merged together take the weapons off and it just drops on exactly the same as the T-Rex just like that and then you can position the hands out and give them the weapon and give them the dragon dagger now unfortunately I don't know if this is just mine or if they're all like this but the Green Ranger doesn't fit as snugly inside as the Red Ranger did in the T-Rex armor so he does he swabbles around a little bit it's not a big deal especially if you're just kind of displaying him like this but if you pick him up i mean he might eh, it doesn't look like he's gonna fall out but 
just seems a little bit loose. But yeah, there you go. I think it looks pretty good. I really do. You can see the visor, the head of the ranger in his mouth. It's a little hard to see, but he's there. And I love the two weapons. I think the tail weapon and the dragon dagger look great. So yeah, I'm a big fan of this. I like this a lot. Uh, yeah, not too much else to say. I definitely recommend this if you guys can find this one. I don't think it's too hard um, to find. Usually most Toys R Us's have it, at least all the ones that I've been to. So I recommend picking this up, especially if you can find it on sale or something. I think they're about $11.99 at Toys R Us. And I think they used to sell them at Target and Walmart, but I've been having trouble finding them at any of the Targets or Walmarts in my area. Toys R Us is pretty much the only place I can find them. So if you're happy to pay $11.99 or you can have a sale or a coupon or something, I definitely think it's a fun toy and I definitely think it's worth picking up. Uh, everything included in the set is really nice and the Dragon Zord is a lot of fun. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like and share this video and subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you guys have enjoyed this look at the Battle Armored Green Ranger from the Power Rangers Imagine X line. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching.